Good morning YouTube and welcome to another Creativeverse stream. Um, we are going to press on and do some more diggy dig with um, the rebuilding of the White Hutch because um, uh, yeah we're 18th of October now and we've got until the 30 something, 31st is it? 30 days, Saturday, May, April, yeah 31st to uh, complete this uh, challenge before Halloween. Um, so uh, yeah, um, there's probably going to be a lot of boring diggy dig stuff. Um, so uh, yeah, um, let's just get on with it, shall we? Um, let's uh, let's get down there and go into the world. Um, obviously, um, for the time being, I'm not going to be putting any music on the background, even though it's mine, um, just to avoid any um, future false positives by the uh, machine learning algorithm. Uh, I'm still trying to um, get some uh, response from YouTube on that one. They seem to acknowledge the, uh, the feedback, but uh, they don't seem as yet to be uh, taking it on board as such. Anyway, so what are we? Um, okay, well that uh, game audio seems a little large. So uh, let's just pull that down a, just a just a just a tad. There we go. There. So uh, all right. <coughs> um, yes, my vape is on charge at the moment. So uh, uh, let's while we're here. Let's just make sure that the, um, oops. Let's just make sure that the, uh, the chat is still linked up. There we go. There it is. All right. So, uh, yes, if you uh, are tuned in and you want to contribute, make suggestions, ask questions, what have you, um, do leave, uh, do leave your, your little, no, actually it's over there, isn't it? Yeah, do uh, do contribute in the chat room, and uh, your comment will pop up on screen as mine just has, and um, we will. Uh, I'll, I'll address it when I see it. Okay, let's uh, let's just take stock of where we are. Now this replicator, yeah, that's going to be empty now. This is the one thing with this system. Uh, when you log out, it does empty. Um, that does remove the blocks that you had in here. Uh, I can't remember what it was that we would do. Oh, look, we've got cactuses. Let's go and uh, let's go and harvest those. Give some more a chance to grow. It's only two, but it'll do. Two is better than none. And the uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to harvest this harvest these and uh, maybe get some get some bees replicated in the uh, in our little replicator exploit where are we there we go let's get these done and see how many queens we can get from here and uh, then maybe replicate a few Get our numbers up a bit. All right, let's just have a look. See how many que we got. Three queens. Okay. All right, three queens and forty-one wax. So uh, let's see if we've got any more queens in here. Put the wax in there with those. Doesn't seem to be. No. All right, let's. Uh, uh, where have I got that? Oh, I've got those in electrics, haven't I? Alright, so let's uh, get that. And where's the flowers? Flowers are in there? Yes, flowers are in there. And we've got 11 seeds. We'll leave those in there as well. And let's put the corn back in there. Or the wheat, sorry. How would people get uh, upset when you refer to corn as wheat? 
don't ask me why, but they do. Where's uh, electrics? There's electrics. All right, so we'll put those in there. 36. That's building up a healthy little uh, collection. Um, I did... Oops. Yes. I did say to uh, Michelle that she could uh, come and um, grab a few uh, of those arc stones the other day because uh, she ran out. Um, okay. Let's go and replicate some bees. Okay, so bees need to be on a different block, otherwise you can't place them. So let's go get some wood. Oh, where's the wood? Is that the wood? New? Ah, there we go. Right, uh, one, two, three, four. That's all we're going to need for the time being. And I might actually try and expand this. Do we have any more phases? No. Can we make some phases? Yes, we can. Uh, Alright, let's make another four. That will give us, uh, basically, that was, uh, that's going to double our potential output on the replicator. So, uh, let's and we need four more wood, aren't we? All right. Because yes, bees can be placed on wood. They don't just need. They don't just require leaves. They can be placed on wood. And it doesn't really matter as far as the replicator is concerned. Which, uh, ah, okay, I should have thought of that. We're going to need wood to place every single one of these bees. So let's just grab the stack, shall we? Well, hello, I have two people watching. Do say hi in chat so that I can give you a shout out. Seven, eight, one, two. Ah, missed one. Actually, yeah, we can place some of these while these are while these are replicating, can't we? All right, so that's uh, three of those in there. Let's start duplicating these. Ah, I keep on doing that. Alright, on we go, and off. No, that's not working, is it? Ah, it's because we forgot to put the delay on. There we go. Should that be a full duplicate? Oh. Uh, there we go. Let's do that again, just to make sure it's taken. Alright, so one, two, three... Three. Uh, let's put those there. Add them to the system. What? Why did you not add those to the system? because I pushed escape. Derp. And I keep on doing that. I'm going to have to reprogram that key. Something here. Just make sure they all went. Alright, let's take these three. One, two, three. And put them up here. Add them to the system. All right, so we now got a full complement of eight in there. All right. Let's take 
take these three. Uh, sorry, these two. To give us back our starting three. And one, two, three. Kind of irritating in a way that you have to uh, click them twice to clear it from the last one. But that's okay. It's just a minor irritant. One, two, three. Just take a moment and uh, place these down. Add these to that. Get our two back. And start on this. Seems to be arbitrarily random as well as to whether you have to hit it twice or not. Let's get out of the way of that because we don't want that to materialize inside a block of B. No. One, two, three. Add them to the phaser. See that one we didn't have to. We didn't have to click twice. One, two, and three. Two, one, two, and we're back up to three. One, two, three. Add them to the system. Uh, see, those we do need to do twice. It's kind of weird. Uh, I don't. Whoop, I keep on doing that. That's silly. That's silly, Brian. Don't do that. We just go straight in. So it may it seems to be the first the first reprogramming only. And I did that again, didn't I? One of these days I'm gonna do that and I'm just gonna find myself pinged all the way up to there. One, two, three. Okay, let's add those. Yeah, see again we only needed to to do those once. Alright, let's get these two. One, two. So that gives us three. Now, because I'm going to duplicate all of these over here and effectively double our replicator, I'm going to put our original three back on here. So this gives them a chance to grow. All right. Now, let's, uh, you know what? We can probably release this wood now. Uh, yeah, we can probably release that wood, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna add some more wood here. Uh, 
hopefully by the time we've laid these out and set up the phases, then uh, these will have refreshed and we will be able to harvest all of them. Uh, didn't need that one. So let's put that back because we only need to go this far. Alright. Now for the phases. We're going to use this orientation so we'll hit uh, R and with shift key placed which allows us to place blocks onto blocks with an inventory. There we go, that's just something new. Right, a new bit of information for some people, I'm sure. Um, okay, so let's take that to... Actually, you know what? Let's uh, take advantage of one, two, three, four. Let's take advantage of being able to do this, shall we? Yeah, I came. I I came up with this way of doing things because uh, it started to cheese me off running around, clicking on my connection tool just to make sure that uh, everything got connected. <coughs> and if we turn on, how do I do that? It's the K. No, K breaks links. All right, so let's go back into there. Uh, oh, it's V, isn't it? Yes. So if we hit V, we can see these lines turn on and off. So as you can see, these are all connected now. All right, let's um, see if these are ready. Make sure they they are phasing. Yep, we got them all. All right, let's uh, let's see if these uh, are ready to go yet. Yes, they are. Now, I am fully aware <coughs> that instead of doing this with uh, the bees, I could just do it with the, um, with the wax. Um, but uh, that's no fun, is it? Oops. Doing it with the bees at least allows us to uh, take advantage of some of the natural game mechanics. feel quite as much like we're cheating because uh, yes this is a f essentially an exploit and at some point playful will fix it I have no doubt okay so let's uh, program those in basically what I want to do here is I just want to get a little stock of uh, Queen's ready so that um, when we do get down to uh, planting uh, setting up the bee farm in the mansion <coughs> we have a stock of bees all right so let's pop those in get them going and because we've just placed them we should be able to get 32 bees from this lot here Ah, 
And when you consider we started off with three bees, we've uh, actually not done too badly here. For the first 20 minutes of our stream, we've now got 32 bees. There we go. So let's uh, plant these other three. In fact, you know what? Let's uh, let's plant a few more. Oops, that went the wrong spot. So we've got those going. That's good. Oh, what's the time? Oh, 9.30 p.m. Let's, uh, let's get the night slept away, shall we? That gives me a chance for a slurp of tea. Mm. Okay, so that's bees done. Let us put the rest of our stock of bees in here with our wax. As you can see, we've got 111 already. So uh, we are building up a reasonable stock. Um, what else can we put away? Mushrooms, they can go away. Uh, okay, next thing to do is uh, just go and check our crops. Now I'm trying to remember whether we... Uh, actually put a processor down here or not I can't remember so let's just go and have a look if we did great if we didn't then oh well ah yes there we go there it is okay so in theory we can now um, replant all of this so let's uh, harvest it Got the fallow ground there. That'll have to be dealt with. And of course, we're using our blueprint. Replant these seeds quickly. Ah. Okay, now where's our plow? Have we still got our plow? Where did I put the plow? Well, let's get these other two in there first and uh, see if we can go back and get our plow. Speaking of plows, I was. Uh, observing the other day because uh, I was trying to find it in uh, in the search and I was spelling it the British way P-L-O-U uh, G-H and uh, it, was, it took me a second or two to uh, get to grips with oh hang on no it's the uh, P-L-O-W spelling so derp on my part there as a Brit, it's kind of uh, mildly irritating, and I do mean mildly irritating, that um, so many games insist on uh, using alternative spellings. All right, so let us process up a few more of these seeds. Now, what I really want to do is find some um, turnips and lettuces. Uh, now, I'm trying to remember which biomes they grow in. I'm not actually sure they are biome-specific. I know the horned melons, uh, according to my son anyway, 
Um, the horned melons grow primarily on um, the dead needles version of the grass, which means you'll find them in um, forests. Uh, okay, what have we got going on? Ah, ah, we've uncovered some carpet. I know where there is some carpet. So while uh, those seeds are chopping, let's go back over here and um, get that carpet. And you can just plonk it straight down. Where did I see that? Where did I see that? There it is, 90 of them. All right, so those we can just throw down and get them out of the storage system. And in to... Oops. And uh, into place. All right, so... Bosh. There we go. And... Bosh. And... Bosh. All right, now this... Stairs going down. Okay, and that's that done. <coughs> okay, so we're now getting some of these lights and other things appearing. Ah, oh, dirt. Dirt. Now these dirt blocks here, these are literally just filling the uh, the invisible bit between in this case, the leaf, which is on the ceiling, and the uh, limestone, which is the wall. There's absolutely no point in uh, wasting a limestone wall um, in that. And if I left it blank, then you'd just get... Um, uh, would you get mob spawn in there? I'm not sure, actually, thinking about it. Uh, I'll have to do some research on that. Um... It's possible that if it was blank, it might survive. Oh, oh it might not spawn creatures. But uh, I don't really want to have creatures spawning in these gaps. Because um, if they're spawning there, then they won't be spawning elsewhere. So, uh, all right, let's, uh, let's just throw it, get rid of some more of this dirt in here. Because right. it will help us to uh, uncover some of the uh, structures that we do want to build on, like this here, this floor. This is the entrance lobby way. Um, this is uh, Mike's office. And what's that? I like that. Uh, all right, so yeah, we can start getting some lights in. That's going to help cut down some of the spawn in here on the natural blocks while we still have natural blocks. Okay, let's see how we are doing. All right, all done. Okay, so let's uh, finish replanting this. Okay, any more? Nope. All right, done. Um, that can stay there for the moment. Let's uh, let's go and put these seeds back in the chest. Bosh, and uh, we can get rid of the long grass as well. Ah, okay, so we do actually have some leaves that we can uh, we can place. This is going to help us at no end. Uh, cragwood, there's cragwood leaves. Okay, so let's pop those down there. Let's uh, get rid of that. And where's that? Ah, oh, there's the grass. Okay, uh, what's this? Wood floor and wood wall. Now those I can also place. Because those are starting to appear in the blueprint. Okay, that is 
wood floor, which is that. Okay. And that's a wood slab. We're going to need loads of wood slabs, so they'll be going in the replicator at some point. There's wood floor. Good, that's going upstairs as well. Um, now, the other block that I've used to fill these gaps is grass blocks. So let's throw some of those in as well. No, that's dirt. So let's uh, throw in some glass, uh, grass blocks where we see them as well. There we go. You see the way the blueprint is opening up nicely, allowing us to place more stuff. Uh, now, is that supposed to be? Oops. Well, let's take the plow off. Good grief. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. As a grass block. Okay, what else are we getting rid of? Oh yes, we've got some wood wall here. Now, I know there's some of that required. Uh, where is it? Where's the staircase? We haven't dug out the staircase yet. Oh yes, that was the other thing we were working on last time, wasn't it? This floor and digging out the storage area. I think we'll get back to that in a minute. Um... We'll get back to that in a minute so that we can uh, make a little bit of progress on that. Because once we've got the pro main processing area and the storage areas um, active, then um, we will be able to move out of our safe space up there and come down here. And we'll be able to center our operations actually within the White Hutch itself. Um, I would still like to get a Lumite glove um, because that is going to significantly speed up the diggy dig. What's that? Ah oh, yes, this all needs to come out. So we might as well get that out now. Ah, not all of it needs to come out. Let's, uh, let's get this out anyway. And then we can we can uh, differentiate the roots from the trees, as it were. Whoops! Yeah. There we go. Ah, see, there we go. There's some grass. Let's put some grass in. Okay. Now let's get back up here. Out of the way. And uh, go and harvest some more bees. And then we can start replicating something else. Because our bees. Ah, okay. So the replicator turned itself off, but we are getting the bees. Which is fine. That's absolutely fine. I don't mind that. We could do with something else being replicated at this point. I think what I'm going to do is uh, make some lamps and get those going. And then we can uh, start lighting up our building site. Again, as a safety precaution, uh, what you can do is just flip the switch just to re-energize these in the, um, in the replicator. Uh, now, we've got 64 bees. That's going to keep us going for a while, I think. So let's pick up all this wood again because we're going to need this for chests.
<clears throat> All right. Uh, what did I do? Uh, trust me to get rid of the dirt blocks, in, uh, the grass blocks instead of the dirt blocks. All right, let's just put one of those down there, just as a starting spot. And go put our freshly claimed bees away with the rest. So, uh, oh, I'm going to have to pause the stream for a second because there's somebody at the door. Sorry about that. Uh, had uh, a shoe delivery. Um, all right, where were we? Oh, hey, Michelle. Uh, still got an hour of part four to catch up on yet. How's the petting zoo? Won't hear any replies until I watch the... It's pub night. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't want to interrupt pub night. It's Wednesday after all. Um, okay, so where were we? All right, yeah, so we've uh, managed to turn our three bees into 85, plus the ones that are outside growing beeswax. Whew, that's given me a chance to get my breath back. Um, okay, let me just take stock. Oh, yes, that's what we were going to do. We were going to uh, get some lights going, weren't we? Now, uh, those are the lights that we want. So we need wood rod, coal. Uh, we've got glass, coal and wood rods. All right, let's get some wood rods going. Uh, let's use these logs. Let's use those logs. And let's also get some wood slabs going. You slab. There we go. Uh, we'll just limit it to that so that we can uh, get, s yeah, still forcefully petting the animals. Well, no, it's, it's not that it's forceful petting. It's, um, um, I, I, uh, I'll, I'll think, I'll, I'll think on that for a minute just to uh, get, ah, uh, oh, okay, lunch break, over. 
Ciao for now, Michelle. Take it easy. Don't work too hard. And uh, yes, enjoy pub night. All right, so let's get our sticks. That was a long sibling, wasn't it? Okay. Uh, we could do with some more light in here, couldn't we? Now we need coal. There we go. Let's. Uh, that'll do. All right. So let's craft four of those. Well, let's craft eight of those. Uh, ah, one more. Go on. Why not? getting dark. All right, let's uh, let's reduce the risk of being uh, required to do some heavy petting. <coughs> okay. Uh, those bees are going to take at least a day or so to grow, aren't they? All right. Now, I have not tried doing it with these. So let's see if we can, in fact, oops, let's get our wiring tool on, shall we? No, we can't duplicate lamps. That's a crying shame. Oh, well, never mind. We'll just have to uh, replicate something else then, won't we? Like some more iron and obsidian slabs. So let's get some obsidian on the go first. Ah, again, first hit has to be double clicked. All right. First click, there's the second click. Hey, Biggles. I was watching a stream by uh, Phoenix Talon uh, the other day, and he had uh, this nice little, um, nice little uh, replication station that he built that he's put, um, he's made blueprints for. Now, I don't believe that those blueprints are actually in the workshop. So, uh, well, let's, let, let's just find this out. Let's just find out. Let's uh, have a little look and see if we can find Anything by Phoenix Talon. Okay. So he's got the uh, coal and diamond. He's got a couple of coal and diamond farms. Shuttle lander and um, a lander. Okay. Um, so no, he hasn't actually put those out onto... Uh, Ah, you couldn't actually see that. Because uh, when it opens the Steam Workshop, 
Yes, that doesn't actually appear on the stream. Okay, so, uh, all right. That's um, weird, but okay, fair enough. You'll just have to take my word for it. Listen and believe and all that. So, uh, okay, first click and second click. All right, so let's uh, get that going. All right, now these iron ones, we've got a little bit of a surplus, so we can put those in straight away. Fully populate those. Uh, yeah, what I was saying is um, at some point we may have to uh, design and build a replication station. Um, first, second, hey, let's just turn the interactions off on these. First and second. I already turned the interaction off on that one. First, second. First, second. Yeah, speaking of Phoenix Talon, I wonder if at some point I can get him to uh, come over and give a little review of the of the White Hutch. See what he thinks of the place. Uh, all right, so let's uh, get these going. And these we can get straight away. I think he would get a kick out of the, uh, the NASA launcher. All right. <coughs> and we're back up to full strength on here. Are these ready? Yes, they are. it occurs to me that if we make one of these things that's large enough I think I might have mentioned it in the last stream but if it's large enough then we could essentially turn this into a painting the fourth bridge scenario by the time we've finished harvesting one end it'll have been long enough for us to be able to um, go back to the beginning and harvest again that end. Um, so I'm just keeping an eye on my uh, vapor, vape charging over there because uh, yesterday it, it displayed an error. So uh, I don't know, I've had it for two, three years now. It may need changing. Okay, um, all right, let's leave that, uh, leave that doing its do for a bit and uh, kind of start placing some of these lights in. Doi. That was, uh, that was careless. Okay, hopping up here. All right, those are yellow. That's blue. Uh, and let's get some of these leaves in. All right. Bang. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so let's get some lights in here. Okay. Um, right, I'm going to pick this up now. And I'm going to put it there. Because we're not actually going to be um, using a chest here. I have changed the design of this slightly since the... Uh, uh, original blueprint that we're working from has been made um, and I've also lowered this by a block so that we can utilize this harvesting method that I've been uh, I've been doing okay what's next uh, what else can we play uh, can we get rid of some more of these yes we can get rid of some more of these. all right so we just need some more cragwood leaves to fill in that and more lights. Shame that we can't. Uh, it really is a shame that we can't make use of the replicator system. But uh, oh well. Let's, uh, let's just get these in here and bring this up. So that just uh, requires now. Okay, so that's that. Aha! Stone walls. Now what's that? Oh, yes. Itch vein. <coughs> Now, let's see if we can, uh... Ah, look, there we go. There's some more dirt that we can get rid of. We've got dirt. Of course we've got dirt. Uh, now, that's going to be a dirt block as well, because it's hiding under here. Why did I have that as a wood block? A wood floor block? I'm not sure. Oh, yes, I remember, yes. Because for a while that was where I had a teleporter and I uh, figured I'd have a proper floor underneath it. But it's not there anymore. Okay, so where can we put some of this wood wall? Uh, do we... Let's just jump down here a minute. Ah, look, there's more dirt that we can get rid of. And there's more dirt that we can get rid of. Let's start covering this a little bit. I what I would like to do by the end of this stream is have a loom like glove. As I said, it does cut down on the wear and tear. Uh, the subsidian glove, since they um, buffed it, I was looking for the opposite of nerf then, um, these uh, gloves now are taking no damage with these surface blocks. I took that out again, didn't I? But they are still slow, so... I would like to get a Lumite glove, if possible. Ah oh, yeah, I did put that in there. Alright, so this is the stairs going up to our main floor here. slowly receding it is kind of satisfying to see that 
of course, uh, as I think I mentioned before, um, over on my son's world, I am optimizing the blueprint so that uh, you only need to dig out what you need to dig out rather than just dig out everything um, and have mud and what have you to put back, which is crazy. Crazy! Whoops, that doesn't need to be that, that needs to be that. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm going to be doing... Um, I've decided I will include the... Uh, the hidden blocks above ground level, you know, the, that are in the uh, wall and floor cavities that um, might engender spawn. But I see no reason for doing it below ground, because that's just going to force people to uh, have blocks, like, all under here, for example. Most of this is just dirt um, and grass, so there's absolutely no point in uh, you having to get those blocks. Let's see, look. There's a grass one. I'm just going to make that. Uh, I'll just make it grass. I'll save having a uh, any red under. See, we've still got some red under there. But I'm going to ignore that for the most part. Um, because, as I said, uh, it doesn't matter whether it's dirt or grass, really. Um, okay. Let's uh, let's go check on our replicator. Now I'm going because I do want these to actually replicate. Just going to re-engage the machine. The reason we are replicating these is because we are going to need a metric ton of super extractors. So we are going to need an equal metric ton of these uh, ingredients for making them. do get down to the Lumite layer, which is down in the corruption, we are not going to want to use anything other than these super extractors, because Lumite is a very limited resource. And um, we want to make the most of it that we can, obviously. Okay, so that's uh, given us some more slabs. So let's create some more of these. All right, now uh, before we wander off out of this chunk going down, um, I'm going to just hang around and do a few more bits up here to give those there a chance to restabilize uh, so that they don't disappear. Because um, that is the one limitation on this system. Or rather, this exploit. Um, you move too far away. And yeah, it's the the chunk unloads, and um, yeah, you lose your stuff. You lose your blocks. 
These are ultimately a hedge on top of them. But for the sake of uh, getting rid of the red, let's fill those in. Ah, oh, yes, it's going to uh, hide out. All right, so we won't do that just yet. We won't hide our little water fountain just yet. And it's getting dark again, so... Uh, let's go and make it light. Okay, did I sleep? Yes, I did sleep. Anything in there? No? Alright, so... Uh, yeah, let's try and get rid of these... Uh, let's get rid of these wood, wood blocks if we can. So let's hop down here, because I know we've got them down here. So let's get rid of this and find our staircase going up into the rest of the mansion. If I remember rightly, that's our supporting column here. Then the stairs are around here somewhere. There they are. I'm going to leave that block in there because it doesn't need to be dug out. All of this has to come. digging out now is going to be our uh, ore and mineral storage. So this is probably going to be one of the first storage areas we are going to need to use. So I'm going to dig this out. So that when we get the first of these, aha! First of our secret stash. Yes, there's a couple of uh, little password protected, code protected areas in this uh, little storage area here. stairs. Those are stairs because half blocks let the light through. And uh, as you can see, we've got lights here. And this is a little secret area behind the storage. That um, otherwise wouldn't have any light. But what 
we're trying to do is uncover this staircase so that we can get rid of some of these wood blocks. There they are, they're starting to appear. So, let's get some of those in, and there's the start of the landing. So, let's get rid of these. jumping down a hole and start uh, going upstairs in a civilized manner. Then you'll be surprised just how quickly this starts to take off, build-wise. Okay, so... A bit more. And that should be that for the moment. I think it's too wide. Yes, yeah, it's too wide. Okay, so let's... Uh, pump those in. that is that that's the other one isn't it that's yeah okay and let's plop that dirt back in shall we okay and then we can see what needs to go on top of there all right this needs to come out this goes out into our corridor digging this out, we'll go and retrieve our iron and obsidian slabs, and then we can uh, go on the hunt for the light, perhaps. Get our Lumite glove. Hello new, vo new viewer by the way, do say hi in the chat room so I can give you a shout out. Unless of course you want to remain anonymous like everybody else, like our other two viewers. I know this is very boring, just diggy 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 diggy. But it all needs to be done. Certainly until we can get some uh, excavators going. And that will set, start saving us some time. As the well, certainly when it comes to digging out the uh, the spawning cellars. Uh, I'm focusing on the main mansion build at the moment purely and simply because I want to get that up by uh, Halloween as per the challenge well the challenge was just to build this on Michelle's world I arbitrarily set the challenge to do it by uh, Halloween, so that's on me. Okay, I can see some more lights coming up here. All right, there's another wall. Area. So this, yes, this has to be. 
Right, let's get those in there. We'll get those back in there. Get those. Back in there. And carry on digging. And then at least we will have our storage area dug out. And we can start getting some uh, storage in there. And. out of the safe space and into this area down here. How's your week doing by the way? You having a good week? I hope so. blueprint. Okay, how far back do we need to go with this? Let's figure out how far back we have to go first. Let's turn my torch on. There we go. Now we can see what's going on. Now dog can see rabbit. this level here. Yeah, there we go. There's the wall. storage area squared out. More or less. What's that down there? Uh, get rid of that. What's that? I don't know what that's supposed to be. Oh, 
Ah, I know what I'm looking for. I'm looking for those. That's what I'm looking for. There they are. That grass. Yeah. Okay. So. And there's another grass. What? Oh, yes. And these under here. Right. These arc signs down here. There's a layer of them. These are what um, gives us our chest labelling, which you will see as we get further along in the build. Is it three or four? Three. All right, so that's that dug it out. Let's take this corridor back a bit. It's right. That's actually in the wrong place. Let's move that over here for now. Where's it gone? There it is. So let's stick that there for the moment. And as we're about... Oh, oh they're not quite grown yet. All right, so we'll give this a, another minute or two. And let's um, let's go and get let's go and retrieve our slabs from here. And there's the final growth, I believe, on those last ones. Go and get those. As soon as we've got these. And then we'll go see if we can get down to the corruption layer. <coughs> Might need to make a uh, oh, it's all right. We've got a we've got a diamond glove in our bag. I remember seeing that. So we are good to go on the tier required to uh, dig down through the lava level. All right, let's. Uh, in. Alright, let's uh, put some of this stuff away. Let's get rid of the dirt and stuff. At some point we may start having to throw this stuff away. <coughs> I need... Ah, oh yeah, see there? There is. Um, there is our diamond glove. We're going to need that to dig down through the um, lava layer down into corruption. Now, we're probably going to get killed a few times. So I'm having to stick a couple of Rizzlers together because uh, our stall was out of the king-size ones that I prefer. Um, so, uh, yes. Uh, okay, fossils. Now, what is it we need fossils for? for oh, fossils, we're going to need 
that for the asphalt. Um, so uh, that'll be happening at some point. We'll get that road in there. We might try and get that in early. I don't know. We'll see how we go. See how we go. Yeah, the vape is still charging nicely. I hope it doesn't error because uh, the uh, the I taste MVP battery isn't cheap. All right, so let's get rid of that. Those are the wood things. Ash and wood leaves. Don't need any more of those just yet. Uh, what have we got here? Lava layer. Magnetite can go in there. I forgot to put the fossils away, didn't I? Duh. Okay, oh, what's that? Ooh, ash and wood sapling. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll add that to uh, our sapling store. All right, what do we got now? We can put those away. Was that snow? Why have I got snow? Where did that come from? Uh, all right, those can go away. Those can go away. Uh, Wildwood, Mocha Auto. Oh, we're going to need more of those. Um, okay, let's uh, put this wood away. Uh, ah, I've got to put the sapling away. All right, so we've we we ah, that's what I wanted. Those, put the mushrooms away, put the wheat away, and so let's stick those over here. Good, we got thirty-two of those. We're going to need those. Um, now we'll keep the plow on us just in case. Whoop. All right, we'll do that in the morning. <laughs> we'll do that in the morning. Okay. Let's go and get our crops. There we go, they're all fully grown now. All right, so. easy. So is that. So is that. Alright, well we've got five left, so let's uh, grind up some more of these. Um, Twelve gives us twenty-four for the next planting. So let's... Uh, Take this stuff back over here. Alright. Okay. Yeah, that's all looking good. Let's put the wood away. We don't need that anymore. But we will keep those just in case we need to do some heavy petting. <coughs> and and just quickly get rid of some of these things. And I'm going to do it up here. Oh, missed. Ah, missed again. Alright, let's do it that way then. 
All right, that looks like it's... Put those in. Got any more? No, that's got rid of all of that. Now, where are the doorways? Because it's the doorways that have got the wood floor bit. Okay. All right, well, we'll leave that for now. Uh, ah, we can get rid of a bit more of this grass. Oh, I left the grass behind. Okay, so let's go and put these uh, wood floors away. the plough, shall we? Let's stick it in there with our greenery and other botanicals. Just for safekeeping. How are we on time? An hour and a half. Okay. Let's head down towards the basement. And hopefully Lumite. Okay, we need some stairs at some point. What's going on in there? That's going to ultimately be our mob spawning cellar. Uh, then we've got uh, another cellar down here, which if I pull the door out, that will be... Which one is it? I'm not sure. Ah, yes, that'd be the lava layer, and this is the corrupt. This is going to be the corruption layer. Oh, look at that! It's a crab. Okay, so what have we got going on here? Strip mining, by the looks of it, for resources. Let's head on down to our lava layer. I heard you. Where are you? You in here? Okay, so this layer of lava here uh, kind of precludes our old design of just sort of winding down and then heading off that way to the uh, corruption cellar. Sorry, the corruption layer. So I think what we... Oh, we need to change glove, don't we? So I think what we're going to do is just carry on digging down this way. <coughs> that way we can have a little... <coughs> Whoa! Oh, it's you. Silly pig. Oh, dear. So, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, so we can head on down this way. Of course, once we reach the corruption layer, we are going to have a drop that we need to build up from. Oh, look, there's a diamond. Uh, let's get that. Oh, there's two diamonds. Let's get them harvested. And back there. Technically, I suppose I could use. Oh, look, there's another diamond. Oh. Uh, technically, I could... Oh, that's nice. What am I going to 
going to say? I can't remember now. Oh yes, we are, there we go, there's corruption. So at some point we are going to have a drop, a significant drop going on down here. Uh, just temporarily. Um, because the corruption layer is Essentially, a huge cavern running the uh, entire underside. There we go, you see. So, I think what we're going to do, as this point is below lava, uh, what I'm going to do, let's just put Crouch on. Oh, let's get down to there first. And then put Crouch on so that we can see what we're playing with. Okay, so we've got a couple of columns there, but we are reaching the end of the claim. So what I want to do is um, actually turn back on ourselves. So let's turn this into a landing. Let's put a little landing here. Now there's something that I want to experiment with because I got the impression from something somebody said and I can't remember who it was now. Oh, there's some more uh, of that. Um, that uh, ah, here we go, We're getting corruption. Same. Yes, I did uh, hear tell that um, igneous rock doesn't increase your heat um, level. I mean, you see down there, we've got um, here, we've got uh, corruption and heat meters. Uh, the corruption meter has just gone down and disappeared to nothing. The heat meter is creeping up, so I'm not sure. Now, it could just be because of the proximity of these. But what I want to do is explore the principle that um, igneous rock doesn't burn. So uh, let's, let's get the frown out of dodge for a minute. We'll stand on this igneous rock for a second. We'll see. Yes, our heat meter is in fact going down. So, it might be worth our while, once we get down to this layer, of um, lining our staircase with igneous rock, rather than just, as I have in the past, just blithely put my steps on top of the hardened lava. That's a little way away yet. We have, in fact, reached corruption. So, what I want to do is I really need to find some mineral water. Um, I hear ya. I hear ya. I don't know where you are, but I heard ya. What I do want to do is try and reduce our exertion. A little bit. 
by uh, getting some steps in here. Now, how are we going to heal? Because we need to heal. We need an effective way of healing. So, uh, let's reflect on that for a bit and see what we've got that we can put away. Lava layer. Uh, no, that's not actually lava layer, is it? That's siltstone layer. out and put our siltstone layer rocks in uh, that's limestone all right let's take that out of there let's use this wooden chest for the lava layer for the moment diamond could go in ores Now, I think what we really need to do is get ourselves... Let's check the wear. Where is our glove? And it's not too bad. Um, Alright, let's just... See how much faster than the... Uh, obsidian glove this... Uh, diamond one is. Uh, we really do need to get those stairs done, don't we? Alright, before we do that, let's, uh, let's hop on back over to the safe space and get some stairs going, shall we? Get some stairs built. Alright, the recipe for which is... Wood slabs, twine, and stone rods. Okay, well, I believe we have some slabs on the go here. Yeah, there we go. We're going to need some stone rods. So let's get some stone for that. What's the best uh, to use? Bedrock we're going to be needing to line the corruption layer, so let's not use that. Uh, those we're going to need at some point. Uh, so, yeah, let's just use the regular stone for these stone rods. And these are going to take a minute. So let's get a whole bunch of these done. Um, we've got some wood slabs. Okay. Um, what else are we going to need? Oh, yes, at some point we're going to need a new um, weapon when our crowbar runs out. So let's see what swords we can do yet. Um, what's this? Is this our legend? Yes, this is our. Okay, so for our legendary sword, we need corruption dust and lumite, so that's a little bit ahead of our shelves. Uh. Flux Incapacitator. That's actually not too expensive. One tar, two magnetite, and an arc stone. Uh, what's that one? Uh, the Hidden Temple Sword. That's actually not a bad sword. Um, tourmaline, Wildwood. Wildwood we haven't found yet. At some point we should go on an expedition and find some Wildwood. You know what? It's going to take a little while for our stone rods to chop. So uh, let's go on a little expedition. It's getting a bit late now. Uh, there's a forest over there. Um, Michelle knows where we are now, so there's no, uh, no real mileage in hiding the map. She knows we're down here. <coughs> and so do you now. Hmm. 
Um, so, let's see. Um, Michelle's base is up here. I believe that's Michelle's base, and I think that's Exiled's base up there. Exiled's... Ah, yes. Exiled, if I remember rightly, is in a wildwood tree. So, technically, we can go over to Exiled's place and go and harvest a little bit of wood. Wildwood. So, and that will give us our hidden temple sword. Okay, so here we are. I've discovered a new enemy. Oh, I was wrong. She's up here. I thought she was down here. I wonder who that. What? What? Good. Is that me? Huh? Okay. All right, so uh, this is the wildwood tree. This is all wildwood, I'm guessing. So uh, it's probably cragwood as well. All right, so uh, let's let's go on a little expedition, a little explore. Oh, what's that? Let's have a look. Oh, it's dirt and stuff. Right, let's harvest a couple of flowers while we're here. Because we're going to need yellow diets. Oh, this is... Ah, this is a wildwood tree. Okay. Um, seeing as we're replicating bees, we don't need to... Uh, Take exiles bees. <laughs> what? Killed by a feral pigsy. No. <laughs> <coughs> All right, that serves me right for not uh, for not healing and not realizing that they were inherently aggro mobs. Hmm. Okay, well, guess who's getting a spanking? That's right, you are, Mr. Wild Pigsy. Yeah, little swine. Oh, yeah, he actually is swine. Swine being pigs. All right. There's my death statue. We've nearly got enough of these death statues now. If, I, if I'm, my memory serves. We need 16 for the roof. And there you are. There you are, Pigsy. You are going to get yours, buddy. Yes. <coughs> How's that? Poisoned me. You poisoned me, you little swine. Okay, so now where is my death statue? All right, let's, uh, let's go to the, um, the ground here and find out, shall we? Is it up there? No? Oh, what? Where is this bleeding thing? How could it possibly... It's underground, isn't it? Oh, dear. And the night leafies are out. Okay, well, I'm going to have to dig down for that one. Ugh, oh, uh, that's an interesting mechanic. Get down. All right, so let's 
just filling the top of us. And let's dig down. I think looking at the state of our health, what we need to do is retrieve this and then teleport home. <laughs> And I still haven't got my wildwood. I should have got that first, shouldn't I? You know what? There's some coal there. Let's have that. How much is there? I can't see because it's the... Nice and fast in the super excavator. Oh look, there's another one. <sighs> Joy. <laughs> So, digging down further. Yeah, I hear you, Chizzard. Interesting mechanic, this. The way that it... Oh, magnetite. I'll have that. Sorry, honey, but... Uh Sorry for digging holes in your uh, nearby hill, sweetheart, but uh, <coughs> if it hadn't been for your per feral pigsy, I wouldn't be in this mess. So, how the heck does a death statue died in the sky. Ah, oh, more coal. We are going to have a serious glut of coal by the end of this session. Silt layer? Where is it? <laughs> okay, what's going on here? Right, let's. Oh, I can't save that. I can't do anything about those. So if we do dig all the way down to uh, corruption and fall to our death again, then we're going to lose all of this stuff. But. Yeah, I know. But, but, but. That's chicken talk. Or not chizzard talk. In context. So how deep... Lava layer. Okay, this is not looking good for us. Uh, teleporter, teleporter. Can we make a teleporter? No, what are we needing? Stone rods. <laughs> oh, would you believe it?
Huh. Okay, so let's just think about this for a second. I could reclaim my touchstone, but then I've got no way of getting back to the building site. Hmm. Conundrum, conundrum. Uh, okay, can we build a processor? What do we need for a processor? Wooden vines. Oh, wouldn't you just believe it? Huh. Meanwhile, we are getting hotter down here. down to corruption. It has, hasn't it? It's stuck it all the way down there. Okay. Alright, so dangerous maneuver coming up. Ah, luckily we landed in water. So, where is my death statue? Really? It's at the bottom of the world? That is not good. <coughs> okay. So, retrieving that death statue is going to be a major pain in the butt. Ah, oh dear. Or did we miss it on the surface? No, I don't see how we could have missed it on the surface. We are going to need some uh, some mushroom healing, though. All right. I think what we are going to have to do is get our health back up. One of each mushrooms, I know, is going to get us right the way back up to full health. Uh... Oh look, and there's some stone rods. All right, all right. Let's um, let's make a teleporter. Let's make four, in fact. Where does that go? Ah, oh, that goes up to. Uh, all right, let's. We'll call this. Uh, Call that Rambo Mountain. And uh, let's put down another teleporter here. And um, I've only got one wildwood leaf. Okay, so. Call that one Wildwood Grove. And we'll put Wildwood Flower in it. How's that? Because we can still put some of those. Okay. Alright, so what have we got in our inventory that we need to save? Let's, let's get our coal saved. Uh, let's get our saved. Uh, let's, let's keep the wildwood flowers with us. Um, let's keep those just in case we need to build any more extractors. Um, we'll keep the mushrooms on us just for health reasons. And the rest of it, I think, we can just put away where it needs to go. Uh, limestone can go in the limestone chest. Magnetite. We've got the... what's that? Ooh, detritus. 
Uh, and that's siltstone. We need a corruption chest. That's electronics. What's that? Ah, wood wall. Okay, alright. Um, I didn't know we still had some of those. Let me get rid of those. Uh, let's turn this into a corruption layer. Chest. This is lava layer, so let's uh, let's put that in there. That's uh, corruption layer. Um, salt layer. Did we get rid of those? Yeah, stalactites. Um, detritus. That is just a surface block. Bedrock surface, that surface, that surface. Coral, that surface. Uh, okay, leaves, that can go into there. Um, where's just, oh, that's leaves as well, that can go there. Snow and dirt, their surface. Oh, no, it's wood wall. Snow. Um,. Alright, so uh, ingots, liquids. <coughs> wow, I've got a couple of excavators in there. Let's put that into our electronics and machines. Oh, look at that. I have some teleporters already made. Ugh. Okay, so, well, we're not going to run short of teleporters for a while. Now, where did I put the excavators? Was it up here with ores? Yes, it was up here with ores. Now, these just regular extractors. Eh, not really fast. Mold, that's in the wrong place. That needs to be in the salt layer. There we go. Um... Can we... let's put these... There's mod drops. Mud isn't a mod drop. Coral isn't a mod... well it is a mod drop, but... Uh, no. Okay, this is... Cr more stone rods. Oh, good grief. What's wrong with me? Just not paying attention on this, am I? Okay, so let's get rid of that. Okay, 9:40 a.m. should be nice and warm nice out there. Let's, uh, let's go and get rid of some of some more of these. Uh, Okay, that's that done. Alrighty, let's go back over to here and... See if we missed our death statue up in the treetop. And get some wildwood, which was what we went over there for in the first place. Coming up to two hours. Okay, so let's uh, let's make a, a more thorough examination of the top here. Oh look, there is my death statue. Herp a derp a derp a derp. I bet I see it there on playback as well okay so um all right so we got that <laughs> reclaimed um okay now for the wildwood let's just go over there and do some digging out in one of these trees
trying not to uh, make too much disruption in uh, exiled area. Right, let's uh, take these out. I'm going to try and take down the whole tree because that would take us all day. But I am going to take a bunch of this wildwood and you know what? I'm going to put down the wildwood first. So where's our wildwood flowers? Okay, so that'll take us back, back home. <coughs> I feel so stupid. It was right up in the air, and I didn't see it. I missed it. Okay, so how many wildwood did we come back with? 27. All right, so let's replicate some of uh, let's replicate some of those up. Oh, I feel so stupid. Yes, let that be a lesson to you, kids. Always look in the sky first. Ugh. All right. So, I'm going to get three rows of those replicated. really dumb. Okay, so. Where is it? Hidden Temple Sword. Okay, so vines, stone rods, and tourmaline. <laughs> So where did we have stone rods? That's where we had stone rods. Uh, vines. Where do we have vines? Oh, we need more vines. Alright, let's see if we can replicate some of those. And we'll take two of those for our sword. Uh, let's uh, get rid of some of these drops here. So, two more death statues and we're done dying, hopefully. Um, oh, that was dumb, dumb, dumb. <sighs> okay. Uh, can we, in fact, replicate these? I don't know. Be useful if we can. Yes, we can. Whoa, doing. Okay. All right, let's um, let's replicate some vines. Oh, it was just so stupid.
Woo. Did it again. Although it does have to be acknowledged that I did put that switch in a very awkward spot. Seemed like a good idea at the time. Got one. How many rows of this have we got? <coughs> yeah, okay. That's, uh, is that replicate? Yes, that's coming back. Harvest this as well. It's done. Are these ready yet? Not yet. <coughs> and tourmaline. Ouch. Okay, so. Quite an adventure today. Okay, so the vape is charged apparently. Well, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. In. Okay, so um are you ready yet? Yes, okay. Vines are really weird things. 
Okay, so let's go get a piece of tourmaline. And you know what? Let's fill that other space up with tourmaline. Get some of that replicated. That doesn't go in there. That needs to go in there. Okay, uh, that's wood floor. Sulfur can go in there because that's a lava layer thing. Um, all right, let's go and get some more tourmaline. Yeah, two of those would be enough. Seven. Okay. There's our replacement sword, and let's make a spare. All right. The spare, I think, we can put in here, along with our damaged crowbar. Um, actually, no, we will keep the damaged crowbar on us. Okay, so crowbar gives us 60, that sword gives us 70, so we have upped our damage potential. And you know what, I am going to uh, put crowbar back in here. Yeah. Put the damaged one in there, and yeah, that'll do. All right, so let's uh, clear out some of this stuff. Um, uh, I have completely lost track of what we were doing next. I don't know what we were. Oh yes, we were going we were going down to the corruption layer, weren't we? How's our armor doing? Uh, okay, let's see if we can uh, upgrade our armor. All right, what's the next we can do obsidian. Obsidian. Okay, it's going to require obsidian, leather, miru eyes. Do we have many miru eyes? Yes, we do. Don't have a great deal of leather, mind you. Um, yeah, we don't have a considerable amount of leather. So, what's this? replicate some more of those. Ooh, dark. Uh, 
That's better. Well, we've got two more crafting things to unlock. What are they and where are they? <coughs> Is that an LED? Yeah, LEDs. We are going to need those. Bungalow wall. Right. What's that? Wood wall. Yeah, I don't want to waste the driftwood on that. Uh, the wildwood on that. <coughs> Okay, what's that? Oh, that's our sword. Um, okay. Right, let's put some of this stuff back so that we don't lose it. That goes into lava layer. Um, and... Uh, oh, yes, armor. That's what we were making, obsidian armor. Of course, it's the American spelling. Alright, uh, obsidian, obsidian ingots, only two. Alright, let's get some more of that smelted up. See, these unfortunate, obsidian ingots, unfortunately, we can't replicate because it's not a place to block. So, ah, good, iron. Okay, let's put these iron ingots back, because we're going to need those at some point for, uh, oh, there's a, there's a random obsidian slab and random iron slab. So we'll, uh, what's that wood floor? That wood floor can join that wood floor, stone door. Those we have in the back, wood slabs, okay. Uh, let's put our vines and wildwood away for now. Um, that, why didn't that stack with that? Who knows? Alright, let's um, go and replicate up some wildwood flowers. Is that done? Yeah, these are all ready to harvest again. Okay, so um, what shall we replace? I think we'll replace one of these. So, although we've just harvested that, is that going to disappear? Yes, it is. Ah, and we got to harvest it. I've only just harvested these. I'm not going to cry about that. Go. 
just have it. Have it. Okay. Well, that's interesting the way it did that. That's very interesting. thing. They've now stopped shimmering. And yeah, they do go. Okay, fair enough. Interesting. Now, is this ready to go again? No, it's not. Interesting. Okay, so that's a fascinating little mechanic. A glitch on the... Uh, a glitch on the glitch, as it were. Alright, so let's... Um, what was it we were... Oh, yes. Basic health potion. Just gonna make some of those because that unlocks a whole bunch of other stuff. Cool, which is what we needed health regen, advanced health potion. Now, these are the ones we really want fire resistance. Poison resistance. Where's corruption resistance? It's that one, isn't it? No. That's that one. Okay. All right. So for corruption resistance, we are going to need cactus flowers, which we've got. Dust evil devil. Uh, dust evil dusts, which we don't have. Stalactites, which we have, and trog horns. That means we've got to go and kill some trogs. <coughs> That's not going to be fun. And I am out of tea. Okay. Um, so, uh, hmm. Let's have a little looky look. Alright, let's put this stuff away. Some of it. Right. Uh, that goes in there. Okay, so we've got 57 tourmaline now. That's on its way up. The ores and the coal, we can... Uh, let's keep the coal for a second and make some more... Um, lights. for lights. Uh, how are we doing on the armor? We still need obsidian. That's cooking over here. Alright, so obsidian armor guards. 
which unlocks the iron arm guards. Obsidian breastplate, which unlocks the iron breastplate. What do we need for that? More leather and more leather. Alright, so we need more leather. Let's go and kill ourselves a couple of pigsies. Get some more leather. And, um, test out our new sword. Hey, Biggles. Ooh, one shot. Nice. Nice. Okay, let's get some more mushrooms. All right, let's go pigs hunting in the forest here. Come on, Piggles. It's heavy petting time. Ah, there you are. Oh, who are you? Oh, yes. One shot. Ooh. More mushrooms. I'll have those. I must remember that spot and come back to see if they uh, regenerate. Have those logs, because I know they regenerate. Oh, hello, Piggles. I'll have your leather. Come on. Only one leather a piggy. Really? Nice. Ah, stingy. Oh. Ah, log central here. I'm not going to say no to that because uh, you know what I'm going to take that off for a minute leaves. And that saves us having to replicate them. Uh, not that I need anything but the wood, really. You're going to come and be a pain, aren't you? Crab. Rock, rockster. It wasn't a rock. It was a rockster rock. Okay, Pickles. Come here. Come here. you has got to give me more than one leather at some point. You really, yeah, I mean, you're just not piggling, right? Oh, nearly missed that one. Nearly flew straight over it. Alright, let's start heading back now. I think we've probably got enough leather to complete this armor upgrade. 
I'm certainly starting to get enough logs now for uh, for our chest building marathon. Because, <coughs> of course, we cannot replicate the chests because they are inventory blocks and you can do it with inventory blocks. Okay, let's just... Let's just have this lever. Okay, good to know that we have this uh, forest full of logs. Oh, look at that. Even more logs. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm just... I must be in uh, Log Central here. Discovered a new area. We're obviously heading the wrong way. And there is a lettuce. Terrific, terrific news. And even more logs. Wow. We're getting close to a stack of 300 of these by now. Not that I'm complaining. I'm going to need a, a ton. But we do need to start getting back at some point. Oh, look who it is. Still, where did you go? Ah, there you are. <coughs> okay, and a stone glove. I'll take that. Piggled, you'll be pleased to know the pig 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 apocalypse is over. All right, so let's see if we can. Oh wow, we did head off a long way, didn't we? Oh, we're not that far away, but we are heading in the right direction to go home. So let's just head back in the right direction and pick up a, f a few logs on the way. Oh, what? Uh, I can't say no to these logs, I'm sorry. It's just too good. It's too nice a harvest. Trouble is, you keep taking me away from the building site. I think ultimately, I'm just going to have to teleport back, or rather, touchstone back. You know what, people? I lied. Is back. How much leather do we have? Sixteen. Huh. <coughs> That's not an awful lot of leather, chaps. I'm disappointed.
disappointed. It just saves replicating them. Yeah, night is coming. The night is dark and full of pixies. Continue heading home. Now if you want to look at it. Alright. Ooh, a flower. I'll have that. Okay, it looks like the night spawn has started. Yep, the night spawn has started. So, let's just take that log and teleport home. All right. Okay. So let's uh, put these twines, other botanicals back. Oh, look at that! It's a nice, healthy, respectable um, log hall. Still only... Ah, there we go. Lettuce. Lettuce, lettuce. That's what I need. Lettuce seeds. Okay, so we've got two lettuces. That will give us four seeds. Enough to start our crop with. Means more digging out. I think I'll do that next time. Uh, for now... Oh, what's that? A new glove? Was that our old one? That's our old one. Okay, so let's upgrade. Uh, let's finish making our armor first. Okay, so we got those two. Let's put one of those, which unlocks that. And one of those, which unlocks that. Great. Alright, let's uh, put on our upgraded armor. Okay, so we are now a little bit tougher than we were. And we've got a stronger weapon. So that's all looking pretty good. And it is night time, so let's sleep that away. next? What's next? What's next? I tell you what's next. I need to have a pea, make some tea, um, and at two hours forty. You know what? Another twenty minutes and then I think we'll call it a day. But first, I do need to have that tea refill. So, I'll stand here and just oversee our domain for a second. Or rather, you can do that whilst I go and do the doings, and I will be right back.
Okay. I'm back. Excuse the munching, but uh, I thought I would just grab a mouthful while I was in the kitchen. You know what? Let's uh, go and see how we're suited for taking on the Rambos now. Bit of heavy pain coming up. Wow, you still take some beat, don't you? And there's another lettuce. Woohoo! Okay. Ooh, and what's this? Ooh. Ooh, a big hole in the ground. Whoa! Dang it. Wow, oh, magnetite. I see you, Mary. I see you. Where are you? Where did you go? I see you a crab along to help, huh? Oh, and a night piggle. Yes, that's that. Okay, well, got a bit of leather out of him. Now, magnetite. That's all I came down for. Well, actually, it's not. See who else wants some. Aha! Oh. Oh. Ah. I did not pay attention to my health. Okay. It's Rewengi time. Time to reap Ruwengi. Yeah, you didn't help, did you? Anyone else want some? Piggles, guess what? Yes. And seeing as I one shot you, you must have been the one that was doing me damage earlier. Because the other one, your mate, took a little bit of beating. And let's have these obsidian. See if we've dropped any frames over the last uh, two and a three quarter hours. And it doesn't look like we have, which is good. That is very good news. Right, so. Building sites are that way, so our hole we came in must be that one.
on the wrong one. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else worth exploring down here. Not really. And some more coal. Let's just have that quickly. Uh, teleport out of here rather than uh, waste time and energy diggy digging so up we go Is cleared anyway. Look at that. Okay, well, that's what happens when you go too far out away from everything. Uh, okay, let's uh, let's scoff a mushroom and just get our health back up. Um, let's also a teleporter down here and what shall we do uh, yeah let's put a death urn in there let's use these death urns for something useful a death urn in there and a death urn in there um, let's uh, put this ore coal away. You know what? Keep the coal. And I need to make glass, don't I? So, do we have much sand? Not a great deal. Do we have any glass? No. Okay, so let's make some glass. Make some glass up. And then replicate that. Our lan our lanterns. Paint. That coffee kebab was rather nice. I might have some more. Okay, so let's have all of that lot and go and make this power replicate again. Uh, not too fussed about this. Uh, 82? 62? What? That's a lot of glass. This is so difficult to see. How many have I made so far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more. All right. One shot, two shot thing again. One shot, two shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes, yeah, so I wasn't brought up with Sesame Street, but my kids were. So, go and go. All 
right. Ooh, I can... Ah, okay, cool. I can make a whole bunch of those. And get some more rods cooking. Oh, wow, that's a nice thing. There's some steel rods. A whole bunch of those. Then we can go down and expand our farm a little bit. Now we haven't found any turnips yet, so uh, we're gonna have to see what we can do with lettuce. Oops. So let's uh, let's dig this out. Oh, that's a bit faster here. Yeah. Let's dig the rest of this farm out. find mineral water. That, I believe, I will find in the... Okay, so this is the beginning of that corridor, so we have reached the end of the farm. some really good progress now that we've got a reasonably fast digging glove. haven't got any turnips yet. I am just going to uh, dig them out ready for when we find them.
far with that. Can't fill that in, but I dug it out. Okay, let's just get the rest of this out. <coughs> Take it back to the wall. Corridor, to be perfectly honest. And then we're practically dug out all the way back to the west wing. down here, shall we? Seeing as we have it. <coughs> there we go. Done. All right. Gonna need to go and get some water for this lot. Alright, let's get this uh, let's get this wheat. so that we can jump backwards and forwards to here more or less instantly. Where are our weed seeds? Ah, oh, we left them in the, uh, <laughs> we left them in the processor. Didn't we? Okay, so let's get them out of the processor. There. And... Really? I thought I did 12. Come on. Ah, get ahead of it. Alright, so we'll just chop another couple. And where's our other seed? We've got six seeds there. Okay, so we're going to need some water. 
we'll get that. last four of those and go get some water and the simplest way back is this way now we can just go out here jump down here and get some water Twenty-four for each um, plot. <coughs> so uh, three twenty-fours quickly. Anybody? Uh, Seventy-two. No. Yeah, seventy-two. Long. Just as quick to uh, jump down here, isn't it? All right. So let's uh, let's get this done first, as this is our. our oh, let's have. Let's have that mushroom, shall we? No point leaving mushrooms underground. No. That one. Thank you. Okay, and we just messed up our counting. Because we overwrote one water with another water. Which is a shame, but never mind. These things happen. Alright, so that's got that patch done. Let's get this patch in as well. Because of the way that the blueprints work, I can't actually take advantage of the uh, liquid replication mechanic here. Yeah, C23, we're short. But that's okay, we still haven't dug this out yet. doing. Alright, so we're one water short because I messed up. Okay. 
get another one. Keep nose diving like crazy. And there's our one. And there we have it. All right, let's get this dirt back in place. Ah, now that's a point. I wonder. I wonder. Oops. I wonder if this replication system will actually allow us to replicate. If this does work, then that should make things just a little bit easier when it comes to replicating the lettuce. Stop it from growing. Oh, and 
course we have to wait for two or three minutes. <coughs> so, six. Uh, four, four sixes are 24, so... Uh, yeah, we're going to have to um, do this a couple more times. should have our full complement of lettuces. And then, in theory, we should be able to make sandwiches which are going to be so much better than the bread. And, as we've, um, we have gone over three hours, I think, uh, what I will do is, um, once we've got our lettuce planted, is I will take a minute, I will stop the stream and uh, take a take a little um, a little snack break myself, and then uh, possibly come back with part six. Yes, yeah, part six. Um, after I've eaten. So there you go, Michelle. You'll have plenty to keep you occupied. Plenty of watching machine material. And of course, we still need to uh, do some, make some chests. <coughs> so, let's see what we need for chests. Uh, those stone slabs, wood slabs, melted wax, yeah, we should be good for that. And these, we just need more, uh, ah, oh, okay, we need more wood. Okay, so yeah, we, we can use logs, so that's good. We should be able to make all of those. Which is good news. What the heck are you doing bouncing up to the surface, Millie? Yeah, see? That was a mistake, wasn't it? Idiot. One idiot, Miru. Scaffolding, as it were. Okay, you ready to harvest yet? Yep. Okay, so that's 12. That's half of our lettuce ready. So let's go over and plant them. What it is is they've changed the sensitivity on here on this flying. Yeah, you're not going to let me drop down, are you? A single hole. Okay, let's just uh, get the rest of the lights in here. Where? Huh? Oh, they went upstairs, didn't they? Okay, no worries. No worries. All right, so twelve. All right, so one, two, three, four, five. Six. 
seven. Half the field ploughed and planted. All right, let's uh, go over, back over here. Oh, look who it is! Very nice indeed. Thank you, Mr. Keeper. All right, are you ready to go yet? Yes, you were, but you weren't activated. Dang it, that's just complicated things a little bit. All right, let's get you plowed so we can put you back down. time because I only need six more. <coughs> so let's take this opportunity to sleep. just leaves these and by the time I've ploughed this field these last little bits of field I should be able to just go back and get the uh, remaining seeds which will be good news Half of the farm done. Well, a little bit more than half because we've uh, already prepared the ground underneath these. So, uh, which is the best way to go? This way, I'm guessing. <laughs> Oh, it's a rainbow, isn't it? 
that one I think it is. No, nope, there's another Rambo. Ah, and there is another lettuce. That'll do me. That'll do me. Okay, so... Short fall taken care of. And just as a precaution, I'm going to put them back on there. So that I can... Uh, test the seed. And we are good. Four and the two from that. Yeah, we're good. Alright, so let's just uh, go and replicate our last two seeds. Or rather grind up our last two seeds. And then we can go finish planting our field. And we'll call it a day. was just silly. That was just silly. Where's our six? There's our six. Bosh! And there we have it. Okay. Let's go back over here. And, uh, yeah, we will call that a day. <coughs> well, for this stream, anyway. I'm now going to... Uh, I'm now going to wander off and uh, grab myself a little bit of munch. And, um, yeah, thank you for watching. Um, I hope you've enjoyed um, what uh, I've been doing here. If you do, please uh, tick the like button. And, um, yeah, here we go personal shilling um, yeah if you really like what uh, what I'm up to and you've learned something then uh, do please consider gifting uh, just a just a little bit whatever you can afford I know it is tight for everybody but uh, yeah um, anyway thanks for watching and uh, I will see you on the next stream which may be in a little while catch you later Bye for now.